What's good, YouTube, man? <clears throat> it's your boy, Cole Cole, here back with another banger for y'all boys today. And, hey, I don't know if you can hear it, but I'm very, very sick, but I still got to push up the content. So, if y'all do anything else, y'all make sure y'all like up this video, man. Every like is for uh, the Cole to get well soon, man. I know this not w, uh, WWE related, this is 2K channel, but RIP to Bray Wyatt, man. One of the best of all time. Out of modern era, excuse me, but uh, he will be missed. My uh, condolences go out to his family. And today for y'all boys, man, we got a huge event on the weekend in quotation marks. I'm pretty sure if you play 2K by now, you know exactly what weekend I'm talking about. But nevertheless, man, we finna react to Brutal Sin's video, man. Make sure y'all hit the like button, hit the sub button. He's on the road to 200K subs. Make sure y'all like this video as well. We on the road to 126 Without further ado, let's see what we got to say. Talk about today, and it seems like the community day is on the way. That's a bar. So sit back, kick up your feet, man. Grab yourself a brew, and let's get to the video. You want 2K rumors and news? You in the right place. Want a community that's cool? You in the right space. You want tips? Subscribe now and, and ring, ring the, the bell. bell. Then go to the park and give them hell. The Boot Squad is an organization with all winners. Soldiers up in formation. We all killers. And when you step on the court, yo, you're our dinner. When I play D in the fourth, yo, Kawhi. So you're done, no. Your boy Brutal Sim on the scene, wicked and mean, with a next video for y'all, man. So y'all know what it is by now. Take some time out, bless up your boy, like up the video. Definitely help the channel out, because you know your boy gonna always put y'all up on game and keep y'all up to date on everything in the 2K community. You know we gotta start the video off the right way by giving a huge shout out to the Brute Squad. Anyone y'all got a notification bell unlock, come to the comment section and type first, second, third. Know they getting a Brute Squad. I gotta put y'all up there just to show y'all some love, y'all. Much love, much respect. So we got a few things to talk about. It's not gonna be a long video, of course, but we have some essential stuff we have to cover. And we're gonna start off with this tweet here from Mike Wayne. He says, shout out to our animations, art, and T-chart team for the Jersey stuff. This wasn't easy to pull off. And of course, he's talking about the animations that's within the Mamba mentality trailer. Where Kobe held out his like the signature jersey hold out by Kobe. W A L trailer in the comment section below. I know most of y'all not gonna play the Marvel moments, but it was a W trailer to me. Uh, was it better than the Jordan trailer? Nah, but I still liked it though. I got a reaction video on the channel too. Make sure y'all go check that out as well. But let's continue. And of course, him biting his jersey as well. Those animations were really good i ain't gonna front with y'all now of course this is actual gameplay they recorded from the mambo moment so we already come from that it's gonna be in the mambo moment section of the game but people like even joe knows was asking questions like yo oh snap can we do that in the park pro am wreck that would be fire what do y'all think now me personally what it would be more fire is them putting replay in online multiplayer man i've been wanting that for years now you know the 2k service could only handle so much but how fire would that be they're giving us replay for multiplayer online man so we could go back and capture some footage me personally hey replay would be fire though i ain't gonna lie chat say you missed your clip and you just go back from that game and if you don't got a back to back just take that footage and uh, trim it. You know what I'm saying? That'll be fire to me. That'll be fire. For real, for real. But uh, let's continue on. I hope y'all can hear me. I would love that. But I already know the 2K service could only handle so much. So I, I know, I, I know I'm reaching right now. But hopefully some way down the line, we could capture footage like that. Okay. Let me know what y'all think again about that idea. And the thing that really stood out to me in that trailer, now I did not watch the trailer initially when I did the news video. The news that I did for y'all, I actually had the article and I didn't get to watch the, the trailer until I came home the night. And I ain't gonna front with y'all. You know one thing your boy ain't gonna do is front. That trailer was filled with pro play animations and pro play tech. And the animation that stood out to me was the last shot. That final shot with that follow through. Let's go back and watch it in slow motion. 
that really got me to appreciate pro play and how smooth the game is. Even with the behind the back dribble in the in the beginning, that that Kobe size up combo that he did in the beginning, that between the leg behind the back, it's way smoother, and way more realistic, man. So those. Get to the good stuff. Or will we have to turn on the shot meter for it to show? For example, like this year, it was automatic for it to show. But in 2K24, if we have shot meter turned off, will it show? And he said the dunk meter and alley oop meter always shows similar to NBA 2K23. Wolf responded. I don't know if you all know who Wolf is. He's actually on the 2K dev team now. Someone who played in the 2K league. And he responded to a tweet that Mike Quinn posted a few days ago, which says, I love how authentic jumpers are. If you love the NBA, you will immediately notice we also get animations from pro play that we wouldn't think to capture in mocap. So there are some really unique shots, moves, and passes that change the gameplay for the better. And so Wolf responded. That'll be fine, Joe. I can't wait to see how the jump shots look, man, because you know with that pro play technology, it's gonna look ten times better in an actual day shot. You know what I'm saying? I know a lot of people were saying uh, T Mac jumper didn't look like his, and uh, it was somebody else, but I forgot. But uh, that I hope that new uh, pro play technology live up to the hype. You know what I'm saying? We can actually get authentic jump shots, and animation, man, dribble moves. Even though I'm not a dribbler myself, passing styles. I hope they authentic. You know what I'm saying? But I'm excited, man. Uh, 2K24 is less than two weeks away, man. Uh, two weeks away, exactly. Because uh, uh, today is Friday, the 25th. So. But let's continue. Responding to that tweet saying, like Mike said, you will notice a difference in jump shots very quickly. A lot of jump shots bases got overhauled with pro play. I've been using Kevin, I'm not going to butcher his name, base, <laughs> quick, smooth, and uh, easy to read Q. Okay, so it seems like a lot of jump shots will be fine-tuned or have been removed and replaced with pro play. This pro play technology is really interesting. Remember he had a, a clip going around showing some kind of mocap gameplay and a lot of people saying 2K will never get there. What if 2K start replacing most or if not all the animations with pro play animations, man? That's where it's headed, it seems like. They start with the jump shots now. Eventually, it's going to get to all the size ups that we used to use and be replaced with more. The way, and it got a lot of creators out there. And they're already putting on display what 2K gave them a nice little care package, which includes an NBA 2K24 hoodie, of course, with purple hoodie, um, a PS5 controller that came in a little backpack, of course. And the 25th anniversary ring. A pretty nice man. I ain't gonna front. It look pretty decent. Shout out to these guys. And I hope they enjoy being at that event. Uh, I know a couple of people that got invited, man. I seen a couple of pictures floating around Twitter, man. Shout out to y'all, man. Uh, I know that's. Uh, I know we give 2K a hard time as far as like the VC prices and stuff like that. But uh, being flown out to test the game, really, that's like truly a wholesome experience, man. Uh, being able to meet so many different creators and stuff like that, uh, that's fire, Joe. And uh, y'all can expect builder videos coming soon, man. Early videos, you know what I'm saying? As far as the best, uh, they think builder, but you know I'm making my own builds. Uh, I don't listen to no YouTube and stuff. But uh, that's, gonna, that's my time here, man. Shout out to Brutal Sim, man. Make sure y'all go like, sub up to him, man. Thank y'all so much for watching this video, man. Hope y'all can hear me because I do not feel like we recording. <laughs> but uh, y'all take care, man.